Hi guys, so it's here and welcome back to another health vlog for this week. So this may came, come out on a Friday or on a Sunday and it's actually currently 6pm as I'm actually recording this video. So um, for this week, I'm just going to generally talk to you guys about my mental illness that has been acting up so much lately and um, talking about um, childhood trauma because that's sort of what I've sort of been dealing with for the past week. Um, so, one of the biggest things that I go through when I talk a lot about what happened when I was a child is that my sleeping becomes so stuffed up because I just don't want to get out of bed. And that's just what happens when, as well when you have a mental illness that your mind is just basically telling you just to give in to your... Um, depression and then to stay in bed and that's just what I've been doing lately I know I've said this so many times and over so many years I've been doing this health blog it's actually helped me to realize a lot of things and I will talk more about childhood trauma in next not this week that's coming the week after um I will talk to you guys about um, childhood trauma on my fitness journey talk so that would be next week's topic for you guys it was supposed to be something else but i will change it to this and i'll just give you an extra um video for next week anyway um it's been tough you know um i was abused ever since i was um six weeks old until i was, until I was 13 um just this past week with my counselor we started to talk about my trauma and um it always flares up a lot of my feelings that i went through when i when i was a kid like feeling scared feeling powerless um thinking that a parent would do this to you um and it's twice as more harder for men than it is for women as well and um it's just tough you know um I have so many amazing people that support me, like, I will always have my family as a support system, even though it may not feel like it, and for so many people, it, it will, but with my family, I always know that they have my back regardless, and I always know that, it's just sometimes I just don't feel that way, and that's okay to feel. As long as that you acknowledge that feeling, and that you feel that feeling, you will be okay. I just finished watching an amazing um, Facebook live from my amazing friend Tash who i known for the past three to four years. She did this authentic beauty course in the last year of um, Hive that was my centre here in Tidrigali that closed down in 2015 as well and she helped me learn so much. Not only about makeup, and she was a um, makeup guru back in the day, and she's not anymore, but she's the Tough Love Happiness Officer, and I'm very proud of her for what she's doing these days, and I love her. She goes through so much, and I'm not going to reveal what she's going through right now, because that's up to her to personally tell you guys. But um, she's been such an amazing friend. I just came from her live on, on her Facebook page. And she spoke a lot about fear. One of the biggest fears I have is to get into a relationship. Because I've been abused pre previously, as you know, from my childhood. And it's always stuck with me. Always stuck with me. And it's a learning process that I need to go through to be able to go to my best place as well and that's okay like i said that this will be a little bit about my mental illness and about my childhood trauma and um i know at the end of the day i'll be okay i have so much stuff i could go on with it's a reason why i have my youtube channel because you know what if i didn't have my youtube youtube channel i would be lazy as hell i wouldn't do anything and this channel has helped me in so many ways, and I hope that this channel has helped you in so many ways. So, I'm going to end this video, and this will be about a minute to recap the last two weeks. So, last two weeks, I've been lazy, 
when it comes to my fitness because I'm still getting a little bit confused when it comes to the post and pr and the let me start that again the pre um shake and the recovery shake like I keep getting confused about it and my Herbalife sort of supply is dwindling at the moment because I'm starting to put money in for my um for my Christmas stuff and then it's all out of the way and I don't have to worry about it so that's what I'm doing as of right now um I'm still learning how to properly cook food and that's a ma massive tremendous um thing that I've been wanting to do for two years and it hasn't been until recently I've got off my butt and actually been doing that so that's a good thing so eating is on its way so we're having a tough time on it though, but I'm getting there, which is a big tick. So this is now going to be a probably two to three minute ending of a video, but that's okay. Um, what else have I been doing? Um, I haven't been doing my fitness because of a post recovery and that sort of thing, but I'm going to try and get into it sometime today if I, um, if I actually get off my ass. Ding! But anyway, um, what else? And, like I said, the depression and everything that I've been going through, it's just been like, it's been a massive head screw around for me. But, that's a summary of what's been happening for the last two weeks in like two or so minutes. But, I really wanted to cover a lot about my mental illness and my um, childhood trauma because it's very important to talk about it. It's very important and it's up to you when you're ready to talk about that and it, it's so tough when you start talking about it and I know that for the first three years of my counselling it was just so hard and even to start trying to work on it I didn't want to work on it at all but that is just the journey. But thank you all Thank every one of you for sticking around on my channel. Um, there has been a little bit of de development when it comes to the computer money to my computer. I decided just to track it into um, the 440 that I have already saved up. Um, I'm just going to really save up for my um, computer next year. It's just so much more simpler. And I will start getting that once all of... My Christmas shopping has been completed and I have a ton of Herbalife that I need to. But, thank you. If you haven't seen my recent video, the link annotation already popped up by now. And the link to this playlist as well. Go down below where you can check out all my social medias including my website that I'm still currently editing at the moment. So, there probably will be a new page sometime very, very soon. Um, go check out also more down below where you see all the series that I do post on my channel. I want to thank you all so much for joining me for this video. Remember, in two weeks' time, which will be on the 20th or the 21st of this month, will be the next health blog. But thank you for joining me, and I'll catch you all soon for either a brand new video or what's going on. But I'll catch you all then.